Morning peeps. Morning. <laughs> Time now is, I think this is the earliest start we've had. We've had breakfast Five to seven. at, uh, in our opinion, the best hostel so far. Definitely. And why was it the best hostel? Because it served actual tea. Yorkshire tea. Yorkshire tea. <laughs> and today, it's a bit chilly this morning. It's crazy. <laughs> but today, we're just walking out of Rabanel and uh, we've got a, quite a long trek. I don't know how many miles it is. 15 point something. 15 miles, but it's like this. So we're going to go up, up, up I'm to done. the place we're really looking forward to, which is Le Crustifero. Oh, I'm out of breath already. <laughs> Le Crustifero, where we're going to lay our stones. Um, apparently it's quite emotional, but we'll sort of see how that goes. And then it's all downhill, which you think would be easy, but I think that's going to be a bit easy tough on a bike. One. Easy on a bike. Well, I don't know. And you've got the brakes. So view this morning. If you've got brakes. Brakes on your bike. Well, why wouldn't you have brakes on your bike? <laughs> hey, this is where we are. Can you hear the birds again? They're noisy in the morning. Right, we're going to get going. Catch you later. I'm coming home. miles in we just reached our first village so we're looking for Julie's red poles because that's her sign to say that she's stopped and had a coffee look at the roof on that that's like a patchwork or what how bizarre say hi no I'm bummed because one of the stores in the town yesterday or they had Okay, first a coffee shop done. Um, feeling a bit strange and uh, probably a little bit emotional. We're just on our way up to the Costa Ferro. I thought, oh, you know, it's not going to affect me really. It's just a big sort of iron cross. And it's really weird how you, how you feel a bit emotional as you get towards it. So, uh, anyway, we've got a little way to go yet. That's where we're going. Julie there, Julie and Rachel McLuhan, up there. Okay. I might record it when I'm up there, I might not. I'll let you know. This is it. It's literally just off of a road. I, I just wasn't expecting it to be A, this small, um, and B, this close to a road, but there's all these stones here. There's a little church as well, right next door, so we're going to go and have a look at that in a second. messages like literally everywhere the winds okay right so I have my little stone which my mum gave me thanks mum if you listening to this so different than actually walking along the Masetta. I say the Masetta is beautiful but I really struggled to get my head around that because yeah, it's just, it was just a long road, that's how it felt. There weren't that many wheat fields that everyone talked about that I remember anyway. Uh, but this, this is just uh, completely different. This is all about, I just love it. I think it's fantastic. I'm in a spa. This is like a hot chair. Sit in it, it warms you up. We've got cold pool. And hot pool. And then here we have a little shower and then steam. Which is called Hamana. Hamama? I don't know. It's in there. Here's a walking chair there. And you've got a nice this is a special type of tea. It tastes like fruit and um, scones. Over here is like a massive bed where they, like, the rocks go from here. 
Yeah, it's pretty cool. This is the view from our hotel room. It's pretty awesome, isn't it? I don't know if you can see, but at the distance over there, that's where we're going tomorrow.